Hey guys, what's up? It's Omar C, and you're uh, watching another video review brought to you by BuyMeAnIPhone.com. Uh, the product I'm going to be showing you guys today is the Richard Solo 1800 external battery pack for the iPhone and iPhone 3G. An awesome, awesome product. Um, much improved from the 1200 I reviewed last uh, couple, maybe a month or so ago. Uh, really cool product, so I'm going to show you guys a close up, so I'm going to talk about uh, my experience with this product and why I like it so much, okay? So let's go to the other camera now. Okay guys, so here's the packaging for the Richard Solo 1800. So actually a lot smaller than the other packaging, which is probably a good thing. Basic stuff. I'm going to show you what comes inside. I'll unbox everything for you. I really, I really like Richard Solo and all their, their products. I've, uh, we reviewed their 1200 battery, the previous version of this one, and it was awesome. And I actually still have it and I still use it. And I'm really glad they sent me the new one. So let's go ahead and check out. Let's go and check out what's in the big box. So, you know, this case or this all these things, this this whole package right here, this whole thing retails for seventy dollars, sixty nine ninety five. You can purchase that at RichardSolo.com, and for seventy bucks, he's giving you tons of stuff here. Let me just pull all that out so you can see it. Okay, so here we go. We got a wall charger, a wall USB to USB charger here. Awesome. A double car charger, double USB car charger. So you if you want to charge. The uh, this discharge while you're in a car and, and charge something else that uses a USB. You can use both of them with your car. That's awesome. And a retractable uh, USB cord right here. I probably should take all this stuff out of the plastic. And that's about uh, that's about two feet long. And you can use that to charge the battery. And also it does have an extra tip for a regular iPhone uh, securing latch system here, and I'll show you what that is in just a second. So this is all the stuff you get with the charger. I'd pay 70 bucks just for the battery by itself, but they give you all that stuff as extra. So here's the battery. There it is there, and this is the 1800. Really cool, lightweight. It actually kind of looks like an iPhone when you think about it. You know, a little shape of it. Bam. The design team has something going on there, right? Instruction manual, we'll just leave it in there for now. So let's put this over here. So why, what's the difference with the 1800 between the 1200? Well, the 1800 has double the capacity. And as uh, you've probably seen in the ads in, on, in your Mac World magazine or Mac Life, it has a uh, LED or a point laser pointer and a uh, bright LED light. And so if you, there's a switch on the back here. You switch to on. So now you can, use, you can use the light, or if you want, you can use a laser pointer, which is... Pretty awesome. I don't really have much use for a laser pointer. I don't really do a lot of presentations at work and stuff that would need that. But just the fact that it's on there, I mean, hey, well, why not? At least you, you, if you need it, you have it. And the, the light is really awesome as well. So like, if you're, you know, trying to find your keys, find, put the key in the car or that kind of thing. If you just have this in your purse and you need a flashlight, well, you got one right here. It's built in. That's awesome. I'd love it even if it didn't have those things. And uh, so it, another improvement that they made for this is it has a latch system. Some people complained about how they felt like it was just falling off of the iPhone or it wasn't really supported. So now they came up with this little latch system here, and you can actually still take it off. Let me see if I can get my finger on it. And it comes off. Oops, I forgot I need to press the sides. And that's, that's the cover for the tip, so you don't want to mess up the tip. So here's a light system, and the other one I showed you has the actual shape of the iPhone, the original iPhone, but this is obviously the, the back of this, the iPhone 3G is shaped a little differently, so that's why you need a different one. So you just put that on there, and that snaps on. Oops, wrong way. So actually, so let me show you the latching system when it plugs in. So when it plugs into your iPhone, snaps like so. My volume is turned off, but now it is charging my iPhone. And so, uh, have the indicator light there, letting you know that it is charging it. And so there you go, it's connected to it. I don't feel like it's going to pop off or break or it's not going to fall off or anything. It's securely attached to the iPhone. One more thing I want to make sure I don't forget to mention is that if you go to Richard Soul, you can also purchase the Contour Flip Case, which is basically a plastic case. And uh, they just wanted to show that the uh, Richard Solo 1800 will actually work with this case. And so if you've used this case before, I'm not sure if you do, and I'll give you a better detailed review of this case later on. But it actually has a bottom piece right here that you can remove or push open, like so. And so this will actually work in conjunction with this case. So you can have the, you can have your iPhone in the case, and it will still charge it up while it's in the case, which is pretty cool. And Richard Solo, oops, sorry. And Richard Solo does sell this case on their, on their website as well. See there? So it's kind of nice. Nice little feature. So you don't have to completely take your iPhone out or have it be unprotected while it's charging up at the same time. So just one thing to uh, to keep in mind to consider in case you are you are the type of person that doesn't like to take your phone out of its case in order to charge it. Well, you can always get 
the contour flick and use it in conjunction with that. Now, granted, keep in mind, this isn't, you know, it's pretty awkward to be using an iPhone with this thing on the bottom of it. But, um, you know, this isn't really meant to be just walking around all the time with this piece of strap to the bottom of your iPhone while you're talking on it. This is like an emergency type of thing. So, like, if you're in your office, you notice, oh, my phone is almost dead. I don't have a car charger anywhere near me or a wall charger. Pop it onto the iPhone, stick it in your purse, stick it in your briefcase, stick it in your bag, maybe your pocket. Or just sit on a table and let it do its job and it'll charge it up for you. Like that. Um, and now let me show you also. And also they have a new a new system where you have to press the sides to release it. It doesn't just fall off like the... Some people complain about the 1200 version of this one. Just It just fell off of the iPhone. And so the, the material of this is a little different from the 1200 that I reviewed last time. It is made of plastic. The first one was brushed aluminum, which looked pretty cool. Um, you know, it was it looked pretty nice and solid, but I think making it with this material, it's a lot lighter. I mean, I wouldn't say a lot lighter, but it's it's obviously lighter than the, than the 1200, I think. Don't quote me on that, but it feels lighter at least. And uh, it's obviously still scratch resistant, so it's not going to get messed up or scratched up. I mean, even though it's plastic, it has this kind of textured feel to it. And with the addition of the lights on there, that's awesome. I think that's a great idea that they, they decided to throw that in there just as a little bonus. And like I said, even if it didn't have the lights, I'd still pay I'd still pay seventy dollars for this product. If you have an iPhone three G, you know it is super power hungry and you, you'll drain battery like it's nobody's business. So I think that everyone needs to have one of these in their pocket, in their car, just in case of emergencies. If you don't have your car charger with you, or any type of thing, that you know this would be the ultimate ultimate deal. If maybe you're someone who's always traveling a lot, you don't want to carry a wall charger for your iPhone and a wall charger for this. All you gotta do is carry this. If you plug in your the USB into the bottom here, plug into the wall charger, and plug your iPhone into it, it'll automatically uh, it'll plug it'll charge up your iPhone. And once it finishes charging your iPhone, then it'll charge with the battery. After that, it'll turn off. It has smart circuitry built in, so it'll turn off. It won't overheat or anything. And you'll have both of them charged up for the next day to use. So when you're out and about, maybe on a vacation or whatever, you have half half battery life left. You're kind of worried it might die off on you. Pop this on there and let it sit there for a little while and it'll fully charge it back up. So, and, I mean, in my opinion, that for 70 bucks, you can't go wrong. I think it's something that you should always have with you, especially with the iPhone. Maybe not all cell phones, but definitely the iPhone, and the iPhone 3G. So, this is the Richard Solo 1800 battery, smart battery pack. Go out and buy one now. And that's going to be it for today. And, uh... Don't forget, I have a monthly contest going right now on buymeaniphone.com. Go there. On the right side, you'll see a square banner that says monthly giveaways. Click on that, and you'll see details on what you need to do to win the monthly contest. And I have a bunch of prizes I'm giving away for free. So go check that out, guys. And that is going to be it for today. Thanks for watching.